Come explore the On Aging exhibit hall. You can search for companies by name or by category of interest. And many exhibitors even offer treats and special content that they will email or mail to you if you request it, as well as opportunities to win prizes, like Home Instead, who are giving attendees who visit their booth an opportunity to win a coach bag. And networking is easier than ever. Just press a button and you can chat with an exhibitor, all from the comfort of your home. The exhibit hall is open 24 seven for you to visit whenever you have the time. Just select the exhibit hall tab from the navigation. Happy networking. So let's begin by stepping our feet about shoulders distance apart. Float your arms up in front, draw your palms in front of your heart. Palms are facing each other. To get into the upper body position, you might take a breath. Then you might take your breath, expand your palms, and spiral your right arm under as we are going in the right direction. Let's get into the stance to start. Shift your weight to the left, tap your right toe in, rotate your chest towards the right side, right heel is down, heel to heel alignment, and shift your weight forward. Nice. Lift your heart, find your center of gravity. Then we separate our hands, left hand to our hip, and our right arm extending up about shoulders height, maintaining a soft crescent shape in our arms. The right arm spirals down, and the left arm spirals around. Let's practice with just the right arm. So let the right arm extend out to the right side, palm comes down, circle down, and right back up, palms face one another. Extend, circle down, and up. So let your hand move up the horse's mane, down and around. One more time. And we'll float our right hand down by our side and now just focus on your left. So your left hand comes down by your left hip, palm is down, and then we just spiral around in a circle back to where we started, palm facing down. Just circle down and around. All right, let's put them together. Circle out, down, and around. Very nice. Can we add movement to this? Shift your weight to your right. Shift your weight to your left. Again, finding where your center of balance is. Being aware of your weight in your feet so that you know how far to move to the right and how far to move to the left. Very nice. From our hands in an open position, we'll simply bring them facing one another, lift up on our right heel, and pivot to center. Take another breath, then open your hands wide, spiral your left arm under. We're already in a wide position, so you have a couple of choices to get into the L stance on the left side. You could choose to just shift your weight to the right and pivot your left toe out, and you're in a beautiful L stance. Or you can shift, half step in, and then step out. So some choices for you there. So from here, we'll shift our weight to the left. Left arm reaches out to the left side. Right hand's down by our hip, spiral around. Let's practice again, just with our left arm. So reach up, rotate your palm down, circle down and up. Out, down, and circle up. You might think like you're tossing a Frisbee and rolling down. Very nice. Let your left hand hang down by your side. Let's just focus on our right. It pushes down by my right hip, circles out and around, comes back to starting position. Again, down, up, and around. One more time. Let's put it together. Reach, spiral, come back. And you might just sink and rise as you get used to coordinating the upper and the lower body. And then when you're ready, shift your weight to the left, shift your weight to the right. Now let's really focus on our breathing. From our belly, big deep inhale, 
big exhale. Bring your palms back into center, spiral around on your left heel, come back to center. Press your arms out, float your arms down, and step in.